Hey guys, Moose here. Episode 13 of Stonehearth in Hopewood. Uh, I've been meaning to mention this for every, like, since the episodes I've done, but I'm mildly surprised that there hasn't been, or maybe there has been, I'm just not aware of it, but a trademark situation with this game. Because, you know, Stonehearth, Hearthstone, Stonehearth, Hearthstone, same thing, just backwards, kind of. It's very surprising. In the last episode, we set up the center of town. I think it's looking quite nice. We can do some decorative stuff in these areas, but I'm going to hold off on that for now, because I'm kind of happy with what we've got. We're just going to worry about expanding from here for now. So we're kind of going in four different directions. At this point, I need to seriously think about designing buildings. Um... I'm going to do a full episode on that, or maybe a couple episodes on that, depending on how long it takes. Um, might do like part of it off screen, but then show how it how it works and design a couple. Um, we'll have to see, but there for sure will be at least some stuff showing how to do it and how I did it. Mining is moving along decently, not. The, am I done? Oh, I didn't designate more. I need you to designate more. Like, a lot more. You cancelled what I was gonna do. Stupid goblins. Yeah, do that. Re the Ripped. Hopefully these are not, like... Uh, it seems like there's kind of different tiers of goblins. Some of them are not scary at all. Some of them are like, yeah, th okay, these are the not scary at all variety. But some of them, like, kick my ass. And they'll beat my guys in a one-on-one -on -one fight, even though they're high level. So I don't know what the difference is, to be honest, but there certainly seems to be one. Okay, get this stuff back. Still annoyed that you have to, once they touch it, like it's considered theirs. It's a little annoying. But that's life, I suppose. Not looking forward to tearing down these buildings, if I'm being honest. Uh, we need to do a lot of things. Okay, a little bit more iron. Not much. Like, I really want more than this. I want to get more ore than we're getting. So I'm going to have to... I think that's the first time I've seen us have more copper than tin. But not only do I need my blacksmith to level up, but I need more material for all kinds of different crafts that I want to do. So hopefully they'll uh, move along on this. We're doing okay. We've got four workers again. That's a major step in the right direction. Um, but we could easily start promoting people and lose that very quickly. However, it may be a different issue is we have 12 beds and 15 people, which is slightly concerning. So we're definitely gonna have to start designing buildings. So, design building, building designer, okay. But this is more planting it. What I really want is, this is just the same thing, okay. So maybe you can't actually add to the, the templates yet. I'll try and look into that online, but that may be the case. Maybe we have to do one from scratch, which would be really annoying because then we have to put up ladders and stuff, I think. Maybe I'm wrong. So let's see how these ones are done. Okay, so the first thing they do is do a floor. I know that much. So I guess I'll think about how I want to do that for now. Uh, it'll be kind of complex, probably. We are going to make some walls, though, at some point. Maybe what I want to do is put farms around here first. Is that what I want to do? Let me think about it. Should the farms be near the center of town? 
Or should they be in their own area? Yeah, I think they should be in their own area. So which direction do I want to make farms in? I think this direction over here. All right, well, maybe out this way. What's going on? Oh, hello. There is a lot of you. Oh, they have a sheep. The problem I have with this is once I engage them, that's it. Like, I'm in. So... I'm a little concerned here. I don't know how I'm going to deal with this. Because there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven goblins. That might be too many for me. So what I'm going to consider doing... Oh, goblin thieves. Kill those guys then. Oh, there's more. Oh, there's a special guy. Chieftain RV Scarletfoot, or something like that. Me, Lean Green Fighting Machine. Okay, that guy's probably harder to kill. Okay, the goblins are fighting stuff. That's fine. Uh, let's break this. And take care of the invader too. I might as well just deal with it now. Get some EXP too. Oh, I guess he dealt with it. So where is he going then? Cancel the order. Whatever, they'll kill him. Yo, you guys gotta go home though. We're getting invaded by something. Or maybe it's that thing. I think it's just this thing. Is that bigger than normal? Yeah, it's definitely like a mid-sized one. Okay. Kill the goblin, that's helpful. You guys should definitely go home, though. Are you injured? Is that why you're going slow? No, you're just bored. Alright, well... Hmm. Still not really sure how I want to design my town, but I know for sure the first thing I need is to get my blacksmith leveled up. Got some more iron, that's a big deal. We can start considering making... Yeah, let's make another one of these. I think I already had one. Uh, cleric level 3. I can make one of these. Better than nothing, right? And then I can start thinking about... Yeah, you know what? Just make those. Better than having nothing. And I can maybe think about promoting people. So, how about this? Let's say two bows. No stuff to sell. But do I want to sell you anything? I suspect not. Yep, I don't want to. Okay. So... This is perhaps dangerous, but we're going to look at it. Okay, you have body two, so you'd be better as an archer. Level three footman and an archer's bow crafted by the carpenter. I think you satisfy those. Oh, no, no, no. Wrong per. Okay, I'm looking at the wrong people. Rock founder has a body of one. So you for sure are going to go be an archer. So why don't you do that? And then the other two... I think. Goblin raiding party. Okay. Let's see how he fares. Okay. Footman level 4, that's good. I don't see him shooting arrows. There he is. Alright. This is working out. So I want to loot all the stuff. And then whatever they picked up here. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. So now I want to say, okay, well, what about this protector stuff? Like, I don't know what this is. Let's make at least 
Yeah, let's make one of them. And then whichever person's lower level will have them get promoted. But our blacksmith is working very, very slowly. Uh, daily update. Not enough to get another person, but we're real close. Like, we're right in there, so we could easily get another person pretty soon here. Let's see how the mining is going. Pretty well. Still got plenty to do. Mostly bring it back. So... Let's consider going a little nuts, adding more. I want metal. I really want metal. That's going to be how we provide better gear, I feel. So let's keep working at it. Kind of like, not irritated, but surprised that the... Uh, Blacksmith works this slowly. Kind of wish it was quicker, but uh, that's life. Always feel like I want more people. So let's just make a potter's thing for now, just to so we can promote him when we want to. Technically, it uses up two materials. Say it puts it in a one, so that saves a tiny amount of space. That's trivial to the point that I don't think it matters. I'm really concerned about this, to be honest. Because there's a lot of... Oh, what's this? Oh, that, okay, that's just two... Co I thought that was some weird, like, goblin animal thing, but now it's just two goblins standing close to each other. Okay. So. Right, the sword hasn't been made yet, I don't think. Still waiting for our blacksmith to hurry up. It's good that we're making armor, though. That's a big deal. Maybe we should consider making some leather armor, and that would be... No, it doesn't. There's no archer stuff, so... We need pollo feathers. So maybe we need to get the shepherd. So I think we're... fine overall. With kind of everything. So maybe we just need to make a shepherd. Actually, yeah, let's give it a shot. See what happens, right? So, we'll go to our trapper. Worst case scenario, we can just change him back to trapper. It's not a huge deal. Do -do -do. Come on. Make the thing. Oh, you're eating. You don't need food. Go to work. How's the blacksmith doing now? Oh, we don't have enough steel now. Uh, make another one. That'll do it. And then after that, totally just start spamming out iron. Iron's gonna be a huge deal. Iron and gold are the two that I really care about. Steel we can always make with iron, so it's more limited by the iron than anything else. And then the other stuff... I don't know, we'll see. You done yet? Yeah, you're done. Okay. No, but I want you to close that though. Okay. Uh, trapper, shepherd, go. Blacksmith leveled up. That is a huge freaking deal. Make all of the silver. That's twenty, right? Yeah. Try to level off of that, hopefully. Okay, how can you still not make this, though? Where's the steel going? That's kind of annoying. Someone's, like, using our steel, or it's just getting moved, so he's having trouble getting it. Okay, animal pasture. Let's... is this gonna be just, like... Okay. So we should probably get rid of these. And then do this instead. gonna do... Do they just spawn? I want feathers. But I don't have any chickens, so... How's this gonna work? <laughs> I 
I'm honestly, I don't, I don't know what's gonna happen. I think I had a rabbit pet, but I don't really know the deal, the deal there. No, we, one animal. Does that mean we have a chicken, or does that just mean there's a uh, rabbit here? <laughs> I honestly don't know what that means. I guess we'll have to see. Give it some time. Oh, you're a worker, so you don't even belong there. That's not what I want. This is what I want. Yeah, I don't get it. So is it the squirrel that it's counting when it says animals equals one? Or what? Like, I don't... I really don't understand. Okay, we'll just leave it alone for now. If it was a bad idea, we'll just change him back. I know we saw a sheep up by the goblins, but... Sorry about that. I'm getting kind of tired. Uh, hopefully we just get chickens. Is that a chicken? That is a chicken! We have chickens! But you're not where you're supposed to be, so I don't know why... Whatever. Not gonna question it. We got a chicken out of it. It's like aimlessly wandering around the town. So we should probably make chicken feed then, right? Poyo feed. We need more corn. So I guess the villagers are eating a lot of corn. And then go ahead and make 20 flour and then 10 bread. I could have made 20 bread, but or 15 rather, because we already have 11. But that's fine. Daily update. Net worth creeping up very slowly, but not there yet. My people aren't very happy. I have a feeling that has to do with the village not being that big. I mean, not having that many buildings. We need another dining room. We need, like, at least two more uh, places to sleep, I think. But we're doing okay. I'm sorry if cracking knuckles unnerves you. Uh, I just... some It's a bit of a habit. Oh, screw you, buddy. Hell no. You do not break my gate. Why would you even do that? <laughs> what a dick. That is completely unnecessary. What an a-hole. I have to replace those now. And I'm not just going to automatically make more. I have to queue them up and everything. What a pain in the ass. You have no respect for my town. Yeah, just beat the snot out of him. Good work. Cleric leveled up to four. That's actually real good. Healing is very important. Give me some more chickens, man. Two chickens. So, I don't know, do I have to, like, manually kill them, or is she gonna just kill them as time goes on. We'll have to see, I guess. Kind of wish there was a way to automatically replace these, but that's fine. Uh, it's hard to see where it's supposed to go here. There we go. And this one... Right there. Cool. We got them back. Okay, having trouble. There we go, zoomed out. What is this? Oh, hello. Yeah, sure, why not? Maybe you have some gold or something. Kill that guy. Good, the cleric is going. As long as the cleric is going, I'm fine. Like, I'm not worried. Let's see how the mining is going. Real well. Just need to carry stuff back, so we'll let that happen. Yeah, yeah, I told you to fight them. I know he's there. Got a small healing tonic. Some silver ore. That's fine. Better than nothing, right? 
Just more stuff to haul right now, though. There's like, it's odd. The enemies seem to kind of spawn in the same places over and over again. They're not very randomized. They're just kind of in similar areas consistently. Okay. Just working through the silver. That's good. Did I want to promote? Yes, I did. Okay. I need to figure that out. So... This one is newer and has higher health, so I need to make a night shield. I did not think I, that was what I needed to make. I thought it would be the sword. Night shield, night shield. Where is that? It's not that one. It's not that one. It's not... Oh, I guess I can just... Cool. Yeah, that's easy. Do it up. Might as well, right? I mean, I'm assuming that it's in some way better than just a normal footman. Hopefully. I really hope so. <laughs> Since I'm sacrificing levels to do this, I don't know if that's like a... I don't know how levels work, to be honest. It might be a character-wide thing. So, like, if once you've leveled up, you get stat boost, and then that applies to your character always. Other than not being able to craft stuff outside of your current class. Something like that. I don't really understand the process, frankly. Let's get rid of our malls. We don't need those anymore. Uh, I think we're in real good shape. I'll keep the wooden sword. I'll keep these just in case I need... Oh, I already made the shield so I can promote the guy now. Uh, you guys are gonna die. You're just gonna make me loot stuff because you're obnoxious as hell. Or not. Oh, they are. Okay. Whatever. Alright, promotion time. You change jobs. Night. Maybe I should read the descriptions on these. Uh, defensive combatant focused on protecting allies from harm. Ranged combat unit that shoots foes with arrows. Okay. Cool. So maybe let's make some arrows, right? So I don't know how this works. Wait, it wasn't here. It w who made these? Who the hell made arrows? The carpenter, right. I still need Poyo feathers. So... Interesting. It seems like this isn't like, oh, here's an arrow, you shoot it, and then it's gone. Goblin sends it out. Uh... Cool, so he just left. Lovely. Can I go take his shit? Nope. Good, he's gone. Okay, I was legitimately concerned about that, to be honest. Alright, what level's our archer? Let's see where he's at. You are apprentice. Okay, so you can't do shit. Okay. We're gonna have to level people up. So let's... Go kill these wolves. Please, everyone go... Okay, good. Everyone's going at once. Okay, we got Poyo feed. That's good. Net worth is one short... Come on. Really? A single unit of wealth short? That's what you're going to do? That looks cool. Okay, I'm just going to do these one by one, because I'm lazy. Okay, is there anything else for you guys to kill right now? Don't think so. Just kind of hang out, I guess. Take the coal back, take the jerky back. Alright, well... 
perhaps a relatively uneventful episode, but uh, I guess making a knight and a shepherd is somewhat eventful. I shouldn't say that. It's a pretty decent episode all around. So, either way, I uh, hope you enjoyed it. I'm trying to think if there's anything else I need to do this episode or not. I'm honestly... Oh, dude, we have so much iron. That is so good. I'm really happy about that. We can make 20, right? Yeah, we can make 20. Very happy about that. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed the episode. Going to end it here. Uh, should be back pretty soon. This seems to not only be probably one of my most popular series right now, but it's also honestly what I enjoy playing the most. And I miss playing it when I don't record it for any period of time. <laughs> so, like, even even if you see me recording this, like, I'm probably long-term going to have my own playthrough somewhere else that I'm just playing off-camera. Not because I want to learn stuff, but because I just really like this game. It really scratched a few itches for me that other games just weren't. Um, like, I periodically get an urge to play Banished, and every time I do, I'm just disappointed because it doesn't reach the potential that I believe that kind of game has. And this uh, gets closer. I'm not going to say it totally hits that, but it's definitely closer. Let me just queue up some chicken feed. No, I can't. So, anyway, uh, I hope you enjoy it as much as I do. Uh, but, yeah. Either way, thanks for watching, and uh, hopefully see you in the next one. Take care.